Hey guys, Matt Laidlaw here. So this is one of the nicest 2016 Street Glide specials I've seen, if not the nicest. So uh, I asked the owner, uh, a friend and customer of mine, if I could do a quick video on it and kind of show off some of the work that he did. So again, this is a Rushmore Road Glide, brand new. So it has the new fairing on it and all the Rush Rushmore project upgrades to it. And I'm gonna go over some of the accessories he did on this thing. So he's got this really sleek center console piece here, and this is not genuine Harley here. It's a Russ Warnemont piece, and it does not come painted, so you gotta get it painted. He went to a site called colormatch.com or something like that, I can't remember exactly. But it came out looking really good, and the color matching is pretty dang close. The bars he went with are Carlini Menace Apes. They came out looking really nice. He chromed up the switch housings and everything. So yeah, that looks all complete. He went with the Screaming Eagle Heavy Breather there. It's a Vance and Hines header pipe. Now the front end, he went with an Arlen S chrome front forks. Really sleek design. These are not genuine Harley, I'll stress that again. The upper fork sliders as well are not genuine Harley. This is an Arlen S front end. And that fender is a Clockworks front fender. The wheels are genuine Harley. Those are the Harley Davidson Aggressor wheels and the matching brake rotors. The turn signals are custom dynamics LED turn signals. Again, good shot of the air cleaner. A lot of the chrome you see on the bike are genuine Harley. The, he the header pipes there are the Vance and Hines. Uh, I'm not sure what mufflers he went with, but they sound really good. These are genuine Harley Davidson extended bags. So they're ordered from the factory and, and painted and color matched and everything from the factory. I will add his front fender, the Clockworks fender. He also sent to that uh, colormatch.com as well. The seat was done by a local company called CNC. They do some pretty nice custom seat work. So the floorboards and shifter pegs you see there, that's all Harley Davidson stuff. Uh, that's like some, one of their newest collections that come on the CVO bikes. He's got the Boom Stage, stage 2 audio front speakers, the six and a half inch. So in the amp that feeds 150 watts per channel. Stereo system sounded really good. Uh, I'm not gonna let you hear the stereo system because it had copyrighted music on there. I, I can't show that. He's got the trim on the windshield, chromed out switch housings, mirrors, the grip it. Those are Harley Davidson grips. They're called grip it. Custom mirrors there. Those are Harley Davidson as well, I believe. He left the fender all clean, so he's got no passenger seat back there. Chromed out the clutch master cylinder and brake master cylinder. That's about it. Pretty clean road glide. Let me know what you guys think.